Hey, it's been a while. I just woke up and uh, I wanted to make a video today. I've been wanting to make a video for a while. Uh, just to see how you guys were doing. I hope everyone's doing good. I'm doing good. Uh, life is good. Um, it's crazy, but it's good. Um, a lot has changed since I recorded my last video. I moved back with my moms and uh, pops, trying to save some money because it's just insane right now. Um, so with that being said, I don't have any of my art gear. There's just no room, so that's a big reason why I haven't recorded much. Um, I haven't been able to do any artwork really. Um, <clears throat> but on the flip side, I've um, decided to go into a new career. I've been really falling in love with cinematography and just really been fascinated with how movies are made and how scenes are lit and just how to get that cinematic look to an image that we all love and watch. So I'm gonna see how things go with it. Um, I'm about to have a another child and um, I'm getting ready for that too. Uh, me and my wife are really excited for our son Sam to be born. Um, we did a lot of praying. Uh, we had hoped and prayed for a boy and um, God has heard our prayers and we love him and thank him for that and um, we pray and hope that our son comes out healthy and strong and that could happen any day today or tomorrow the due dates the 17th of this month so yeah that's um kind of the update some of you been asking where i've been at that's kind of where things are at now mm, i'm gonna try and draw and do some of that here and there. Um, but I think majority of the posts that I'm gonna be making are gonna be documenting my journey as a beginning filmmaker. Um, so if you guys wanna watch that and kinda see how things go and if you guys wanna see me grow and grow with me, that would be super cool um i did a short documentary recently um and i'm gonna show you guys that now um so yeah check it out let me know what you think and um i hope you like it Усі ці почуття, як весні. Мій батько вирішив піти на війну. Добровольця. Найважче у цій війні те, що людей змушують воювати. Я наполовину українка, наполовину росіянка. Мій тато з Росії, а мама з України. Ви це розумієте? Це означає, що росіяни змушені бувати власних родичів і українцям нічого не залишається, як вбивати їх у відбиті.
Мій батько є громадянином України вже понад 25 років. Він любить мене, мою маму, і я знаю, що він сильний. І я розумію, чому він бореться. Для того, щоб захистити його сім'ю і дати нам краще майбутнє. І за це я його люблю. Але я не хочу, щоб він воював на війні. Я просто хочу, щоб він і моя мама приїхали до Америки. Щоб вони могли зустріти своїх нових онуків. А я ще хочу прилетіти, полчаса поселка Ценечка, посмотреть телевізор. Опять такий-то город зайняли наших персонажів. Угу. Так хорошо. Надо посмотреть. Меньше штурмовики, да не как я. Десант на штурмовые батальоны. Спасибо, что вы понимаете. Ну ладно, Катя. Все тогда. Потому что ты сидишь там, снимаешься там. И ничего не говоришь. Так а вы же телевизор смотрите. Гудбай, Америка! Пока, пока. Гудбай, Америка. Все, пока. пока. Мы вас любим. И мы вас любим. Красавица. Еще когда я была в школе, я встретилась с провидицей. И она мне сказала, что у меня будет трое детей. Та два браки. Але я в це не дуже повірила. Але зараз все змінилося. На даний момент в мене другий чоловік. І я очікую на третю дитину. Я вдячна за мою сім'ю. Мій син, Сай, моя донька, Йо-Йо. Та майбутній син, Сам. I'm really proud of this. There are a lot of things that I would like to change and um, mistakes that I saw that I made. Um, but that's good. Like, that's how you learn and that's how you grow. But I, up till now, like, I'm, I'm really happy with it. Um, I've just, you know, really recently got into filmmaking and editing and learning all this stuff. Uh, it's only been a few months, so I think for right now, I'm pretty happy with how it looked and how it turned out. Um, it was a one-day doc, um, a one-day docu-competition. The rules were it had to be one day, find someone, um, an interesting story, and so I chose my wife. Why not? Um, I think she has an interesting story. I definitely don't think that one day was enough to really tell her story. So I may in the future um, do another documentary 
really kind of getting a lot more information. Um, but it was going to be, uh, or it had to be just one day, two days maximum. So the first day I did the interview, uh, kind of got the lighting and everything set up for that and the composition, uh, recorded that. And then the next day I did kind of more of the B-roll stuff with, um, Sai and, um, with my daughter, Yo-Yo and with Kate. And so we kind of just went out and filmed that day. And, uh, the winner got a FX3 camera. So a Sony FX3 cinema camera. That was the prize. And came up short. Um, didn't win anything. Uh, I didn't get an honorable mention, nothing like that. Um, but I was just happy to participate and uh, had the opportunity to participate and to learn and grow. They're going to do like a screening of the other documentaries that won here pretty soon. So I'm excited to see um, what they ended up doing and, and how it looked and the story. So, um, but yeah, I'm going to continue to try and grow as a filmmaker and I'm just going to document my journey and um, hopefully you guys uh, ride along with me and grow with me and um, if you want to learn and you want to start filmmaking and it's something you've been interested in hit me up um, I'm super down to learn and to grow and uh, to give any knowledge that I have at this point so thanks again uh, I love you guys and I hope you guys have a good day see you next time